here. I want to talk to you today about contextualization. You're going to be writing a paragraph this week that contextualizes the subject that you're writing about for your essay. And I wanted to explain this to you a little further. I once saw, I think it was on Yahoo Answers, someone had written in asking what the word contextualization meant. And the reply was, that's not a real word. That's just a word your teacher made up to confuse you. However, that's not the case. Contextualization is a word, and it means to put something into context. Now, if you think of what the word context means, well, one definition is the circumstances that form the setting for an event, statement, or idea in terms which can be fully understood. So, for example, say I'm writing an essay about my mom. Now, my mom had a disease called lupus. So if I was going to tell her story, I would have to include that she had lupus. But I can't just assume that my readers know what that illness is about. So I would need to give them some background information, telling them the details about the disease. Um, and that's kind of a problem sometimes we have as writers when we're writing. We assume instead that readers already know what we know. They know what we're talking about. They know about the subject we're writing about. And that's just not the case. Instead, we need to assume the opposite. Assume that readers don't know what we're talking about and tell them, give them that background information, give them insight into the subject, tell them what that subject's about so that we can move forward with the story and readers understand uh, where we're going. So sometimes a good place to put that contextualization can be after your introductory paragraph, if you had introduced that new idea in the beginning. So say I have an essay about my mom, and I mentioned that she has lupus in the introduction. In even the second paragraph, I could go in and just give a little background information about lupus to orient readers to the subject, and then move forward with my story. So that's all it is. Contextualization is a big word, but really has a pretty simple meaning. And if you have any more questions about it, please feel free to email me and ask me. I hope that helps you understand it better, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.